Hey everybody. Uh, apologies if I sound a bit shitty. What the fuck? Don't, don't, don't turn into me, mate! Oh god. Well, that's a good example of getting my subject today. Um, but no, anyway, uh, yeah, like three days ago, I think it was, I went to the doctor's for a checkup. And I was sat in a waiting room with a load of people coughing their heads off for, what, 40 minutes, hour. And unsurprisingly, I now have some form of virus which is slowly attacking my throat and my lungs. And I suspect tomorrow I'm going to feel like utter shit. But never mind. I did go to Emsworth this morning, which is a place near my place. <laughs> um, and I thought, I don't know, I'm going to have a look down there see if there's anything new. But, um, well... Okay, well, this is what it is. It's kind of boring. Why did I bother coming down here? In fact, I'm just going to do a U-turn. Yeah, there you go. It was boring as hell down there. Um, so, I basically gave up. Um, and then something dawned on me today. That, no, it's not dawned on me today, but it sort of dawned on me that today is one of those days. You know they say about things like Sunday drivers and that sort of thing. Well, I prefer to say it's Friday drivers. And I'm pretty sure it's down to the fact that it's Friday and everyone's about to get the weekend off and all of that gobshite. But, um, the days when you're riding around and just everyone seems to be trying to kill you. What are you staring at? Hi! Hi! You're looking, yeah, there you go. Ow. Yeah, um, you know, some days, I'm pointing at that again. Uh, you know, some days you get people that just, you know, you're riding around and you're, you're not riding any different from normal, but everyone's trying to kill you. Like this morning, as I'm going round and round about on the way off the island, a, um, a BMW decided that they didn't need to give way to me and they just sort of carry on going over the line at 25 mile an hour. And she didn't realise that at the speed that I was going and the speed that she was going, she was going to catch up with me because I was going around a fucking corner. I was going to have to slow down a bit. Um, and she nearly went up my ass and then proceeded to sit right up my ass for nearly two miles. And I was like, what the fuck? I ended up having to like lean around and point my camera and just say, back the fuck off. Uh, which she did then, which is funny that, isn't it? These people seem to have a problem with you until they realise that you have a camera on you and then they're like, and then they're like, oh, maybe not. What was the other one? Oh yeah, I was going down a, uh, a single lane road. The left hand side, the entire side, my side, should we say, this side, imagine here, this is a foot of grass and then a ditch. On the other side, you've got a pull-in. What does the car do that's coming towards me? Is he gonna go in the pull-in? No, he came straight past it and then shook his head at me as he nearly forced me into the bloody ditch. And it's like, hang on, mate, you've got the only pull-in and you didn't use it. So I'd like to know, statistically, is it proven that some days have a lot more accidents than others? Like, I suspect it's going to be Monday mornings and Friday afternoons when everyone's rushing and getting back. It's not... I mean, Wednesdays are another one, actually. I know it sounds ridiculous, I might as well just say all the days, but no, Wednesdays, I've noticed, they're another day that people um, don't seem to pay much attention to what they're doing. But, um, yeah, anyway... Yeah, does anyone know for a fact? Is there actually stati I know there's statistical data available uh, on such things, but I don't know how to access it or if we can access it or anything like that. It'd be interesting to know, like, if there really are days you need to watch out a bit more. Uh, I mean, it's like on days like today when I indicate. Oh, yeah, someone said this to me in a video the other day. Are your turn signals not working because I was, I was hand signalling? No. Sometimes you get in a situation where someone's coming up behind you and you're indicating and they don't seem to back off at all. And you just get this, uh, this funny feeling they might hit you, you know. They might not stop, they might run straight into you. So I tend to double up my, sig my signalling with a hand signal as well to make it absolutely bloody certain that I am showing everything I can to indicate I am moving that way. I think it's just one of these things you, you just pick up on um, over time. It's fucking typical, isn't it? You go to the doctor just for a checkup 
and you end up coming out sick. Oh, I know it, it's going to be a chest infection, I can tell. It's when you can taste that horrible shit that's building up in your lungs. Oh. I hope it's nothing serious. Like, it's going to last any longer than a few days because I've got the burn up on the ninth and I'm going to it whether I'm sick or not. But... I'd rather not be sick, obviously. Uh, I don't actually know where I'm going, because as I say, I was supposed to go to Emsworth this morning and have a little explore around there, but it's the most boring, godforsaken area I think I've ever gone into. Hang on, didn't even notice they've actually put the tower up now, or the circus tent. It's the Moscow Circus. I like saying Moscow instead of Moscow. Oh. God, I am starting to feel a little shitty. It's a bit more than just coughing now. I'm starting to feel proper like, oh. Uh. 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 It's funny, when you like this, I know there's other vloggers. I know there's other vloggers that are out there the same as this, but when you're ill, it's really difficult to do vlogs. And if you're not in a good mood, or you're overly tired, you can be really, really crap at vlogging. So I try not to do it in those times. But tiredness is something I sort of am used to. I can deal with the tiredness. I've had that for, well, a long while. <clears throat> right, I'm going to keep this one short, save my throat. But, um... Oh yeah, thank you to everyone who's left me very, very kind messages on the 4000 sub video. Um, I really do appreciate it. Put a big smile on my face yesterday. The only down on yesterday was when I started realising I was getting ill. I was just, you know, you get a little tickly cough and you're like, hold on, this, is, this, this isn't just a tickly cough, this is going to be something else. And yeah, sure enough, they wake up in the morning and you're like, oh, actually, I'm okay. And then you stand up and you're like, oh, dear God, no, I'm not, no, I'm not. <laughs> Uh, anyway, in fact, I think I'm just going to do what I've got to do. I'm going to go home and I'm going to go and sit in bed. Not in bed, just on bed. <laughs> anyway, um, I'll catch you next time. Old man. Holding. All day. And I did this for 200 subs, I think it was. And this one's for 4,000. It worked last time, so I'm hoping this will help me keep growing. See ya!